John Wall and the Washington Wizards playing host to the Milwaukee Bucks. And John Wall getting things done early on. First of all, blocking a big fella, going up and just stuffing Jabari Parker. You got to see this one one more time. John Wall had a pair of blocks on the game. This just spectacular. Later, Wall, watch the spin here. And then Markeith Morris is cutting. He's going to find him. And Morris goes up and stuffs that one in. And Washington leading at 42-40 at that point. Matthew Delavadova finding Tony Snell. And Tony Snell finding the bottom of the net on this three-pointer. He had 20 points on the game. It's 49-45. And John Henson finding Giannis Kumbo for the two-handed jam. And Milwaukee up 57-53. In the third, Otto Porter Jr. playing well, finds a pass from John Wall and finds the bottom of the net for three. Then Wall finds Porter again for three, and Washington's up 63-59. to But the Bucks bench stepping up, Michael Beasley with a little fadeaway here. He had eight points on the game. Then it's Greg Monroe spinning inside and making the bucket. He had 16 off the bench. And Milwaukee's got an eight-point lead. The wall finding his teammates late. He had a season-high 16 assists on the game. Here he finds Bradley Beal for the three. Bradley Beal finished with 22 points on the game. Then it's Marquise Morris for the jumper and the lead. And it's 99-98 Washington in front. Wizards working the ball around again. This time it's Otto Porter one more time from three. He had 32 on the game. Washington up by four. Giannis trying to respond, trying to keep the Bucks in this thing. Spins and slams here to cut the lead down to two, 104 to 102. Wizards up to John Wall is fouled. Goes to the line and missed the first free throw. He would make the second free throw. So it's a three-point game. That gives the Bucks a chance. Giannis looking and finding Tony Snell. Snell gets a look at a three, but it doesn't go. The Wizards get the rebound and they get the win by five. Final score, 107 to 102.